Okay. Yeah. It is. But the problem is that I've sprayed this one, so don't eat it. <clears throat> but they are, uh, that's a good point. Actually, capsicum annuum, ornamental peppers are very spicy because uh, the only problem is they're not really all that tasty or edible. They're not bred for uh, taste or for the amount of spice that they have, but rather bred for the way that they look. So typically, ornamental peppers are extremely hot, but don't taste very good. So people don't like to eat them all that much. Okay, it's got a typical pepper-like uh, foliage on it. You you see the sort of light, not nice dark green foliage with sort of the lanceolate shape to it. Okay, and uh, you see here. Actually, I didn't know we had any more flowers, but we do. This is a typical pepper flower. Okay, see there. Yeah, they're very small because of this particular plant sits relatively small peppers but you typically see a, a small uh, flower there anyway you see the six little petals there white that's always the color of uh, pepper flowers and then obviously you see the the fruit that occur there and the only reason that ornamental peppers are used is for the fruit so there are a number they're so uh, variable from one to another we see some peppers that are rounded. We see some peppers that are this cylindrical look. Some peppers that are much larger than this and, and sort of cylindrical. <clears throat> some peppers that are um, cylindrical like that, but they're, they're twisted. So they sort of have a, a, um, a, a nice little textural change to them. One I can think of, a uh, cultivar called Medusa. Uh, yeah, it's sort of a, a rounded mound but the peppers are twisted and it sort of looks like Medusa's head right, in that way. Um, so there's a number of different cultivars. Uh, you can imagine the different types of fruits. So then you can imagine the different uh, growth habits. Some of them are nice rounded mounds like this one would likely be maybe a foot, foot and a half tall max. Some of them are four or five foot tall and more upright. Okay, so it's very, uh, unique uh, or very variable from one to another you just have to sort of know ornamental pepper okay look for the green nice dark green foliage with the lanceolate look look for a uh, the, the small white flowers uh, that occur and then look for the, the fruit which is pretty obvious okay <laughs>